Today I'm going to film a little classroom organize and clean with me. I'm so excited for this because A, my classroom's gonna get cleaned. B, you guys love classroom setup videos because you love seeing organizing and cleaning and stuff. So we're gonna do that again today. I'm just excited because today is Friday and it is the start of winter break. And so I'm just gonna stay for like an hour or so and just kind of like organize, clean, and just get everything ready so that when I come back in January, I do not have to spend my time cleaning. I can just spend my time planning and getting ready for the next trimester. So we just had our winter party. So my classroom is a disaster you guys like i am not even kidding like so messy and everything is just everywhere and i need to really deep clean this so we're gonna do some deep cleaning and some organizing and getting things ready for the new year a fresh start i don't know if i'll rearrange the furniture or not maybe we'll see what happens but i know for sure i need to take like the tape that i put on the tables lasted up until literally like last week you guys um i'm gonna try and show you this like there used to be tape right here like dividing the names i think that my kids don't need the tape anymore i think so i think i can just take it off and not put it back on but if i end up thinking that i need it back again i'll just put it back on later but i think i'm just gonna like clean slate, take everything off, take off the name tag things. Also, guys, pro tip, if you are a teacher or a first year teacher and you're buying supplies, the Michaels name tag holders do not recommend because they like peel off because they don't, like you can't close them and change their seats ever. I would not recommend those. The Target ones are good, but they were out of the Target ones when I realized that I needed more. So I'm just gonna take them off and we'll just tape them down probably. Yeah, so I'm gonna organize and clean and get things ready and I'll take you guys along with me. So, let's get cleaning. Also, if you are new here, my name is Haley. I'm a first year kindergarten teacher. I'm so happy that you are here. If you wanna see more of my journey as a first year teacher and teaching kindergarten and all that fun stuff, please make sure to hit that subscribe button so you can see all of my videos and also give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed. And let's get cleaning. Hold up, I am on my way, I'm in motion. Let's go to the ocean. Yeah, let's go outside. Okay, so I finished cleaning three of the tables. I had to stop filming it because I wanted to charge my battery. So this is what they look like all clean. And this is the before. I don't know if you guys can tell how gross these are, especially where the name tags are. Like, ugh, and you can see the lines, ugh, so gross. And I clean their tables every single day. So like, this is like, just really, really gross to me. And so now they're all shiny clean. So I'm gonna clean the last one and then um, move on to the next task. Okay, the next thing that I'm gonna do is kind of just organize this area and wipe off my boards completely so that it's like nice and fresh and clean. That is what I'm gonna do now. Out on the beach without freezing Yeah, isn't that amazing? In Christmas times We'll be chilling and having a good, good time Doesn't matter if the snow is falling
Okay, so I just redid this board um, and moved all of our math daily routine stuff onto one place, whereas before it was like spread out onto two boards. And I like it so much better because then we're all just right here. All the things are here. This is just a poster one of my coworkers made. So this tells the exact routine that we do. And so we have student leaders do this. And so it actually works out really well that the kids like have visuals to remember what we're doing. And so, yeah, I really like how this turned out. I like it a lot better all on one board, so. you guys can tell but like it is getting so clean i'm so excited you guys like this feels so good just to have it like a fresh start i don't know we just really really needed this deep clean just to like reorganize things just get things like in place and new places you know we've adapted and like kind of started new routines and stuff that i didn't have like the right system set up for and to be completely honest with you guys like teaching is freaking exhausting <laughs> and so by the end of the day i never want to do anything and also my school gets out so late at like 4 15 which i don't know if that's considered late i think it's late so by the time that i like get gathered and like can breathe for a second it's like 5 p.m and like i don't want to stay till 6 p.m every single night to like reorganize things so i just feel so good right now <laughs> to finally get this stuff done like 
the tables, just having the tables completely clean, like a clean slate. I reorganized all that area. This is all redone. I was not happy with how my boards were set up, and so now this is starting to feel really, really good, and my back table is all cleaned off after the party. I like reorganized the markers. This is brand new that I just set up in the last vlog. I can link that vlog up above. Another thing I need to do is kind of just like go through these drawers and throw away like the stickers that are empty, reorganize like all the things, go through my little copy thing and see if there's anything that we didn't do, which I know there are things in here that we didn't do and get rid of them to have a clean slate because we're not gonna do like wintry kind of stuff once we get back. Um, my library is actually pretty clean because I just reorganized it a few weeks ago and so I just kind of have to move these um, book bins back. Over here I'm going to go through this stuff like crazy because this drives me bananas. I am not happy with how this is but my kids are finally finally starting to get into like puzzles and games like they have really like loved doing those recently and so I need to organize them to make it more like Assess accessible for my kids to use them better. I also want to make this into a writing center and have just like different writing paper that the kids can use with like fancy pencils or pens or something that um, just to kind of like get them into doing writing during like free choice time. I am going to make this into like a science center. I'm going to make that a science center and like make a cute sign or something and like get a little basket that they can bring in things from like recess like leaves and stuff or rocks or have like I might get some like cool crystals and like make a quick little like worksheet like what does it look like in your hand what does it look like under the microscope something like that just to like amp up some things to be completely transparent with you guys these are projects that I've wanted to do since before school started like these plans are things that I have wanted to do since August and they just haven't happened and that's just reality of being a first year teacher like or just a teacher in general you can't do everything you have to prioritize and as a first year teacher like I prioritize like getting used to a new curriculum getting used to a new school getting to know my coworkers, getting to know my kids organizing everything getting the resources like it just was not my top priority to add on like extra things like that that are not necessary per se like the word work cart, I could just do like worksheets instead or whatever, you know, just do like every day have something rather than having like independent stations. Anyways, I'm just blabbing, but basically I'm doing a lot of the things hopefully over winter break that I have wanted to do since the beginning of the year, but I just have not been able to barely breathe to be honest with you. So I'm going to finish up. I'm probably about three fourths of the way done as done as I'm going to get today. So I'm going to reorganize this stuff. And then this um, bookshelf is probably not going to end up staying there. I'm actually going to flip around the mailboxes as well and make the back of that cart, which is magnetic, into another word wall. But that's not going to be today. That's going to be another vlog. Um, so I'm going to organize all of those kind of toys and just make sure they're in the right bins um, and just kind of make it, you know, how it's supposed to be and then reorganize this part and then I will probably head out because it is almost four o'clock and so I have been here longer than I thought I would be but honestly it just feels so good I don't even care I I have needed this <laughs> so let's get back to it it's cold outside but the fire keeps us warm we can't spend the night underneath the mistletoe and I've gotten you a present that I put under the tree. Tomorrow it is Christmas, the first for you and me. The snow is falling down, and the storm is on its way. But as long as you're around, everything will be okay. Cause all I want to do is spend this holiday with you tomorrow it is christmas the first for me and you i longed for this moment to have you for myself in a cabin out of nowhere just us and no one else i've decorated everything to be perfect for this week tomorrow
Alright, the very last part that I have to tackle is my desk. It is a disaster. <laughs> Tomorrow it is Christmas, the first for me and you. I longed for this moment to have you for myself in a cabin out of nowhere, just us and no one else. I've decorated everything to be perfect for this week. Tomorrow. Tomorrow it is Christmas, the first for me and you. I longed for this moment to have you for myself in a cabin out of nowhere, just us and no one else. I've decorated everything to be perfect. All right, you guys, this is the after. I'm about to head out. I think that it looks a lot cleaner, like I can tell a huge difference. Let me know down in the comments if you can tell a big difference too because it just feels so much better. There's still some things I wanna do like turn that around. I need to like organize these shelves a little better. But for like two and a half hours, let's see, what time is it? It's like 4.25, I started at like what? 2.30, so almost two hours. I think I did pretty good. Cleaned a lot of things, organized a lot of things, so this is the after. But that is pretty much going to be it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please make sure to give it a thumbs up and make sure to hit that subscribe button so you can see the rest of my videos. I will definitely probably be coming in at some point during winter break to finish up some of the projects that I wanna do, put their name tags out, do the new word wall, and plan, obviously. So make sure you subscribe so you can see the rest of the videos, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye! Christmas in my heart And I can promise Santa's coming to visit